You're probably here because you have an Oogie device which requires you to uninstall all previous and existing drivers off your Windows system. And when you try to install Oogie's driver, it still persists that you have a graphics driver still installed on the system even though you know you don't. That's because it's detecting two hidden WinTab DLL files in the operating system. So before you can continue with your installation first, you'll need to locate these two DLL files and delete them. Head over to File Explorer. Next go to the drive which has Windows OS. In my case, mine is the C drive. Make sure you have administrator privileges and use the search box function to find tablet.dat and pen underscore tablet.dat files. Delete both of these files. So once you've deleted those two files, you now need to find the WinTab files. To do that, you need to go back to the C drive or whatever your main drive is. Then look for the Windows folder and double click to open. Now you're going to search within this folder. Type in syswell64. Double click to open this folder. Now search for WinTab. Then delete this WinTab32.dll file. With one of them now deleted, go back three times. This should land you back in the Windows folder. This time search for System32. Double click to open the folder. Then search for WinTab again and delete this WinTab32.dll file. And that's it! You should now be able to go back to installing that Oogie driver you needed. I hope this video has helped you out. Likes, subscribes and shares are always loved. I hope to see you in another video, but until then, bye!